Caterpie is a caterpillar, and that's sort of it. Gen 1 generally has an aesthetic of design that's more grounded in reality, obviously not completely, but more grounded than later generations. And one of the results of that is that design-wise, Caterpie is a caterpillar. Metapod is a cocoon, and Butterfree is, well, it's a humanized butterfly with little feet and hands and a human-like face construction. And so the Caterpie line is actually a good case study in how Pokemon handles designing insects, because where real-life insects often have hairs, wiggly feelers, tendrils, bristles, and pedipalp mouth parts, those features can also be kind of off-putting. So Pokemon design tends to smooth insects out and apply a lot of stylization to avoid them becoming real enough to be creepy. And as a person who's creeped out by bugs, I appreciate it. It's hard not to be at least a little charmed by Metapod's dopey eyes, Caterpie's adorable proportions, and Butterfree's anthropomorphization. Enough to forget, for at least a second, that butterflies in real life actually have incredibly creepy mosquito-like faces. I don't recommend that you Google them. The Caterpie line makes bugs appealing, and that's all the reason anyone should need to want Pokémon to be real. Subscribe to this channel for more reactions and hot takes, or head on over to my main channel for longer in-depth videos.